Welcome to the Keeping It Broad podcast, the show that explores the fascinating world of home improvement and renovation. Join hosts James Carlosi, Tim Pesh, and Mark DeLucia as they share their expertise and insights on the latest trends, products, and their involvement in the industry and community. Let's get into this week's episode. Welcome to another installment, what do you call it, installment or show or edition of Keeping It Broad, the official podcast of South Broad Paint and Home Center in Wallingford. I am very excited today because our official South Broad drummer is joining us today, Mark DeLucia. Welcome aboard. Um, And uh, we thought Mark would be great uh, to partner with when it comes to uh, a little bit of bathroom talk. So we're going to do a little bathroom talk today uh, at South Broad. Mark is our bathroom aficionado. Mark, welcome aboard. Thanks. (laughs) Glad to be here, guys. My first and last day on the show. (laughs) First and last day on the show. Something that Mark and I uh, are really uh, similar on is we uh, welcome taking risks when it comes to design. Right. And we're starting to see that trend also as some of our customers and some um, design, you know, new products and all that. Yeah. I mean, when it comes to bathrooms, especially, you know, I think there's. You know, it's really important for people to take in the big picture and, uh, you know, have some fun with it. Yeah. You know, there's no uh, wrong answer, right? There's no wrong way to do something uh, when you're using the right products and the right people are in play. Uh, you know, there's really no wrong way to, to do it. So at the end of the day, it's it's personal, right? Yep. There's a certain yep. Yep. Um, personal choice from color standpoint and, and texture and style. But take some risk, you know. Throw some color in there. Do a little green or blue or gold or. Mark, black. look behind us. I mean, yeah. this 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 backdrop here of this this yeah. black walnut and the, right. the blue vanity top and these integrated mirrors. Mm-hmm. Um, take a risk. I, I I you know I laugh because you know growing up in, in in our home you know we had the standard oak cabinets with the sure. brass hardware and the uh, the twelve by twelve tile, and um, you know. It, it's sometimes it's hard to break that mold, but there are so many options, and you're seeing new products come in, different colors. You're seeing a lot of that come in now. And there's a lot of great uh, products coming into the market now. Uh, we sell a lot of major brands from Kohler to Delta to Moen. Yes, I uh, want to talk about that too, Mark. Behind you, I have an anthropology uh, display here. This is another backsplash that we yeah. have. This is just an example of some of the some of the cool stuff that has started to come in. This is anthropology? Is this, that's... Uh, it's actually called anthology. Oh, anthology. The be- that's anthology. That's the Beatles, right? Right, Anthropo- <laughs> right. But anthology is the line, and uh, in that line, there's a ton of collections available. This is a glass, uh, beveled glass, uh, that can be used as a backsplash or an accent in a shower or what have you. But, yeah, a lot of cool products in the anthropology line. Very cool line. products, not anthropology. Not What's anthropology? anthropology? That's a subject in scholarship. Right. <laughs> That's over. That's over my head. <laughs> but you know enough that that's yeah. not it. Um, yeah, you know. <clears throat> listen, if if you want white subway tile, we have plenty of options yeah. for you to to, to choose. But right. we're starting to see a lot of things come in now that um that are just uh, really cool and really right. exciting. I think you're doing a a bathroom now, or you just did one recently in Southington, Connecticut, mm-hmm. um, where you had to be a little crafty with your design to make the, the yeah. flow work out good, and it yeah. came out pretty cool. Well, it worked with Schluter closely, our local Schluter rep. See here in the hat, thanks, Joe. <laughs> uh, and and the design of the bathroom was was a little um, where the placement of the drain had to go was a little unique in the type of uh, knee walls that we built. Uh, so that's a fun one, and that's what I'm talking about. You know, yes. there's a lot of fun yeah. um, textures in that bathroom. We'll post some pictures, uh, and that's wrapping up soon. But you know, again, the homeowners were open to the idea, um, and, and it's important to also understand. And I just want to state that, you know. We, we ultimately leave this up to you, but we try to present to you all the ideas and all the options so that you can make the best decision uh, and understanding what's available to you. You know, behind me here, there's a lighted mirror. Those are super popular right now. And um, lighted, that's actually a lighted recessed medicine cabinet that's dimmable. So, so much cool new functionality and features available um, that's available to homeowners. And a lot of people don't really know that they're available to them. Um, this floor that I'm sitting on is a heated I was going to ask you about that. Um, you mentioned Schluter, and there's a heating system. Yeah, stuff. I mean, Schluter is uh, an amazing company, a um, lot of innovation, um, and they're constantly working out to make products and functionality better and more uh, accessible to everyone. But, yeah, heated floors, yeah. heated shower floors, heated bench seats. 
uh, custom niches. I mean, so many fun things that you can do in a bathroom these days. Um, well, to stay in, in, in the bathroom, because we're doing bathroom mm-hmm. talk, um, do you, and just in its name, um, are you getting a lot of calls for, for baths, or is everything going to showers? Are you seeing a, you know, a yeah. sway? It's definitely the last few years, a uh, big swing in, in bathrooms, at least from, from what we've been doing. And, and what people are recognizing is that we are uh, probably a handful, only a few people in the state that do what we do from a, from a retail showroom design build uh, perspective. Uh, so you can come into our showroom, which we own here in Wallingford, and you can look at all the products that are available to you. Uh, we have several of them on display, some of the, all the new features, and we'll design the space for you, and we'll actually do the build-out. So, again, uh, kind of a unique uh, process in the way that we do it. Uh, we are working on a did-you-know kind of yeah. you know, yeah. platform right. so people can understand that, hey, did you know that? We could put that mirror in for you. Yeah. Did you know that we can heat your bathroom floor? Did you know that you could just come in and buy the tile and we can talk you through the work if you wanted to do it yourself or have a friend that did it? So lots of opportunities. You know, it, when, when, they, when they get in contact with, with uh, you, because you've become like the liaison on the, on, on the bathroom portion of this, and you know when it comes to plumbing, electrical, and all that, they just work right through you, right? Yeah. They, they don't have to go find a plumber. You're going to take care of everything yeah. for them. I, and that's what I explain to people. It's that if you want us to do it, it's a single source um, contact. So yep. you, you work directly with me. I put my team in place, and uh, depending on the scope of the work, we have – we always put the right people to do the right job. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. that's really important for people to understand, too. We don't use jack of all trades. Right. We don't we use guys that are expert experts in their fields, whether it's a plumber, an electrician, a carpenter, um, our right. tile team. So these are all people that are highly skilled and trained in their specific fields. And we've been working with them for, for a very long yeah, time. Yeah, we have good relationships with all <clears> our people. You can walk through the showroom at South Broad and um, and we, we have some other news coming too about a, you know a, a new showroom expansion coming soon and, and mm-hmm. you'll hear more of that as, as time goes on yeah. um, but you can pick out your whole bathroom here we can go through your cabinet selection for your vanity yep. your flooring we can walk over mark behind right behind you there's mm-hmm. you mentioned mowing and there's we have we have fixtures and faucets yeah, and all yeah. that and showers oh, yeah. and yeah. you know rain shower what are those what are those called those, yeah the, the rain showers oh, yeah those and things the, are awesome handhelds yeah so many cool things and mm-hmm. I always tell people you know the internet's your best friend yeah. If you don't have, if you have no idea of what you want, yeah. and you want to talk to us about some some thoughts, you know, just just use the internet. Just gather some pics, gather some inspiration. Yeah. Uh, we'll send you links. We'll 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 walk you through the entire process. If it takes a month, if it takes a year, um, there are some projects that take a lot longer than others yeah. for people to wrap their heads around it, to understand the products, understand the the cost expectations and and the scope of work expectations. So. Yeah, I mean, we'll we'll walk you through the whole thing. What would and just you just mentioned something. Um, the, what is the the budgeted time? Meaning, like I know, in every kitchen, I'm sure is different. But what can a customer expect to be out of uh, of their master bathroom or primary bathroom um, within within a few weeks of each mm-hmm. other? Yeah, master bathrooms, uh, you know, you know, can take a lot longer. You know, certainly more and more people are adding more features and functionality to those spaces Um, a a full redo of a master bathroom can take anywhere from four to five weeks um, perhaps longer Uh, but guests or spare bathrooms hall bathrooms um, with a tub uh, you know in it we can turn around usually within you know three to four that's pretty good so so pretty pretty good uh, turnarounds on that. Um, I know that seems like a long time for some people, but there is a lot of moving parts in bathrooms, unfortunately, and it takes a lot of work. If uh, if you have some cool ideas about how you want to um, renovate uh, not only your, your bathroom, as we talked about today, but your kitchen, your home, um, include us in that. We want to be part of that conversation. We want to be part of that, that process. Yeah. Uh, we would love to see some of your designs. Um, and send us your dreams and send us some cool exactly. stuff. Exactly. I tell yep. people, send me, send me whatever you got. What do you call it? Inspiration, Inspiration. photos. Inspiration. Yeah. yeah. I mean, whether it's something you saw when you were on vacation or a friend's house or your neighbor's house, send me pictures. Um, you know, most of the time we can, we can design something exactly like that or very similar to it in your space. Um, we have a really fun, uh, Kohler 
shower component going to be going in that's actually relatively new to Kohler. Uh, had to buy this part from the Midwest. In fact, couldn't get it around here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, uh, we have some cool stuff. And the homeowner, again, was was willing to take some risk, wanted to try something new and do something funky. So uh, we're excited about it. And uh, we'll we'll show you that, too. And, and, just, and just in closing, uh, taking risks in terms of design does not always <clears throat> mean spend more. No, not always. Not necessarily. Not and always. And that's very true. And yeah. taking risks can be simply... Uh, using some fun colors, doing fun designs and textures within the tile. Yep. Uh, you know, the vanity, uh, like the one behind me here, which you really can't see, but, you know, using different species of wood in the vanities, different layouts, uh, does not always mean spending more money. Twice as much. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Not, not, at not, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. all. Um, I'm hanging out in the bathroom with Mark Lucia today. Uh, that is Mark. I am Tim. Come hang out with us, South Broad Paint Home yep. Center in Wallingford, Connecticut, 1267 South Broad Street, uh, live and local. Thanks for hanging out. See you next time. All right, guys. Take care.